All right, I know it's a little late, but the uh, Sega Genesis Classics Collection just activated on my PS4, so I thought I'd give it a little bit of a shot. <clears throat> One moment here. Spread the word a little bit. Shut off Discord entirely. Close Chrome. Oops, that got rid of my. Oh, shoot. That got rid of my chat window. One moment. I wonder. Man, those are the only room settings. I want to put up different posters. I want different, you know, sheets on my back. I mean, those are extremely 90s core, but... Okay, so let's get that back up. Let's suspend the Twitter window. There you go. Alright, pop out the player. Pop out the chat. Pop out the chat. There we go. There we go. And it looks like I'm all synced up audio wise. Excellent. Alright, just as a little bit of a starter, I'm also going to test out one of my new. Uh, audio things there we go we'll see how that goes um, cool okay that's a decent volume all right so a couple of things that I think I'm going to play I'm gonna start with Sonic the Hedgehog um, I need to use it for I need to use some video footage for this in the near future doing it this way I won't have to import it into share factory so let's play a little bit of Sonic the Hedgehog Sega! sure that one's familiar to Drex he <laughs> I did run some smoothing filters just to see what they do like Remember, I don't have spin dash. The last time I played this, I kept trying to spin dash. Got me into trouble. made it in less than a minute. I know it could be better, but eh. I'm not trying to speed around this. Oh, 
goodness. That's probably the fastest I've done any of these. Game audio is drowning me out. All right. Hey, thanks, Trez. Nice to see you. Give me one sec here. I'm going to pause that. I turned up the audio earlier because uh, I was recording something else and didn't care about my voice. There we go. Should be better now. Do -do -do. How did I not hit those goal thingies? Hit that one, of course. Now I'm out. Okay, good. Haha. You thought you could hide from me, did you? I think not. that anyway. Yeah. I love it how in uh, Sonic Mania you can actually burn that up with the fire shield. That was fun. Yeah. Come on. No spin dash. This is Sonic 1. Gotta remember that. Well, Thank you for dropping by and uh, letting me know about the- Hey! Should have had a second chance there. But, uh, enjoy your shift. I mean, as much as you can. But, have a good night. Or, day, I guess, for you. is definitely not happy with me tonight. Oops. Been wrestling with a little bit of decongestion decongestion lately. And so Nope. No luck there. Oh, you work nights anyway. Okay. I used to work third shift and I enjoyed it. Because, like, everyone else was asleep when I was awake, and everyone was awake when I was asleep, and everyone else was available to party when I was available to party, and I enjoyed it. Guess it depends on the job, though. Oops. Game over. Okay, fine. I didn't really care to play this for very long. I've actually really been looking forward to playing some more, um, some, uh, Shining in the Darkness. And I could have done this earlier, but I decided I'd wait for 
this collection. So we'll do this. Well, hello there. Let me just get up. Now what can I do for you? Start the game. Start the game. There we go. Could it be that you're here to seek adventure? Well then, which record would you like to use for your exploits? I'm going to go to record three just to be a rebel. Do you mind if I ask your name? Five characters? The hell? I don't have a five-letter name I tend to use. I've got a six, I've got a four. Oh well, I'll use Tess. Now, how fast would you like your messages displayed? I asked. Ah, I knew it. Tess, is it? I was expecting you. There's something terrible going on in the kingdom of Thornwood. Something I fear could plunge our world into eternal darkness. With your help, Tess, this can be prevented. It's all up to you. From this point on, Tess, you are the son of Mortred. And at night, in the kingdom of Thornwood. Oh, I almost forgot. You've got two good friends now. Milo Brax and Pyramist. Sir Tess, the king awaits you. Please step this way. My liege, this is the one I spoke of. Ah, Mordred's son and one of my finest knights. Tess, isn't it? A fine name it is. A fine name indeed. Majesty, this lad wishes to join in the search for the princess. This was your idea, wasn't it, Theos? Yes, your majesty. As you know, Tess's father was with the princess, and he's been missing along with her. Tess feels that finding the princess will lead, to, lead him to his father as he came to me and offered his services. Oh, I know. This time I'm not going to throw away the shining equipment. <laughs> the princess is believed to be somewhere in this realm. Did you check under the couch? I only pray that she's safe. Tristan, what say you? With your permission, my liege, of all my knights, this lad is the youngest. But he is second only to his father when it comes to swordplay. I see. I don't know why I went Sean Connery on him, but I think I'll stick with it. Well, if Tristran vouches for you, then there is no room for doubt. Tess, bring back my daughter. I'm sure she's somewhere in the realm waiting to be rescued. Take this gold, Tess. Equip yourself and then return here. Yay, 200 gold. We'll talk when you return. You may take your leave now. Ah, <laughs> this music. Do, 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 do. I gotta see if there's like an OC remix of this, because if there isn't, there should be. Bow, bow, bow. Yeah, let's get some weapons. Good day. If it's the weapon you seek, you're in the right place. Outstanding. Pick what you want. There's more if you want something else. No, I don't want the bronze knife. Yes, I want to take another look. Um, screw it. I'm going right to the short sword. Nope. Because I ain't got no cash. Well, actually, I might be able to sell... I love how... I, I never understood why that's happening just there. But I, I love his whole... Ah! Look. Sell my bronze knife here. 75 gold sounds good. Nope. Don't want to sell anything else, but... Um... Now I might have enough for some armor. What would you like to buy? Nope, nothing there.
by shield. There we go. Ah, still not enough for a gauntlet. Come again now, you hear? Ha <laughs> that's a good one. But just a sec. Hiya, Tess. Sorry to hear about your father. The princess should have been safe with your father protecting her. In fact, there's some who blame him for what's happened. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, if it isn't Tess. Sorry to hear about your father. I hope he's all right. There's some who spoke ill of your father, but don't let it bother you. Just keep in mind that we're behind you all the way. Should you need lodgings, just ring the bell on the counter. So, you're the son of Mordred the Braid? Kind of young to be hunting for the princess, aren't you? Son of Mordred, my eye! Don't make me laugh! What you looking at? Come here and I'll show you who's boss around here! Oh, don't mind him. I've never heard a pleasant word pass his lips. I apologize for Norm's condition. He's really a nice guy, you know. Yeah, I decided I'd go posh for him. Nobody believes me when I tell him about the creature. It was ugly. I saw it the other night on the hill outside the village. I'm a loyal knight and servant of Baron Byron. My lord is a gentleman, but he's not been himself lately. Talking to Di and Diane is the one of the highlights of my day. My brother and I like to come here for once in a while for a bite to eat. It seems like he has no appetite today. Okay, time to leave. And I think I have to go wander around in the dungeon for a bit first before... Oh wait, no, isn't Milo in the shrine? Nope, not yet. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> what about NEC? <laughs> yes. I, I had an idea for his voice, but I'm not sure if I can pull it off while my throat is giving me problems. <laughs> oh, yeah. You know, yes and no. I mean, I, I get the impression that a lot of that is just an act, which is fun. I, I mean, that's what some people do. I, oh, I have to go back to the castle. But what's amazing is that usually when a kind word passes his lips, it's usually followed up by something offensive. Hey, gold rat. Tess, I've been waiting for you. Minister, provide him with all the details. Yes, Majesty. Listen well to my words, Tess. First things first, you must find the whereabouts of the princess. It is said she was last seen in the vicinity of the labyrinth. Following someone named Jared with this gigantic package! But we haven't a clue as to whether she's in the labyrinth or not. How are you, gentlemen? <laughs> what? You <laughs> Greetings, King Drake. Who are you? Excuse my somewhat sudden appearance. My name is Dark Soul, and I've come to rule your realm. King Drake, you seem worried about the lovely Princess Jess Jessa. Well, n worry no more, because I've got her safely tucked away. Fiend of fiends. Whoa, Lord Tristan. Another move like that could be your last. Now back to business. I want you out of here, Drake. You must be joking. Speak when you're spoken to, Byron. All I ask for is this kingdom. In return, you can have Jessa back. Uh, this is the one that just came out tonight on the PS4. That's why I'm playing it right now, because I noticed that it was available to, to actually play on the preload. Otherwise, I was actually planning on heading to bed, but you know what? Games first. By the blood of the ancients, Jessa held captive by that animal. Go, Tess. Find the princess. We're depending on you. Yep. 
By order of the king, Sir Tess may henceforth enter the labyrinth. Yay. So, one cool thing that they added in this version of the collection is quick load and quick save just using the right analog stick. So all I... that was it. I just held down on the uh, right analog stick to do a quick save. Move ahead a little bit, quick load. There we go. Slimey ooze! I'm going to have to turn around and leave right away. This isn't going well. Now I can probably handle another one of these. Hooray! Wow. Okay, good, they're missing. That's helpful. There we go. Alright, I should probably head back out. Thank you. Uh, let's see here. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that wanted to do that. Status. How much cash do I have now? 83 gold. Um, oh wait, that's enough to buy a cotton robe, which I think is better than what I've got. Yeah, I've got a woven robe. So, let's have a look. So I could definitely stand to take less damage. Oh, nope. The woven road is better than cotton. Okay. Nope. Uh, well, it's not, that I'm, it's not that I'm not interested. Wise are they who walk in the path of the ancients. For should they be wanting, my services are theirs for the taking. You seem to be fine in both body and spirit. <laughs> but I'm not fine in body and spirit. I'm still damaged. Whoops. Ah, I didn't mean to do that. Go ahead, just take a short break and I'll wake you back up in a sec. If it'll let me. You know what? I don't think it's going to let me. So... Um, well, I did just save. So, no, let's see here, is there a... Whoops. So that's hold to exit, but what brings up, like, an in-game menu? Oh, wait! That's right! I can rewind. Let's see if I can rewind far enough to... Nope. 
that was just slowing down. Huh, weird. I thought there'd be like some sort of in-game menu, but I guess you just have to exit all the way out. Uh, let's see here. I just want to re reset. Oh, there's the reset button. Okay, well. Throw it back in. I want to play a little bit more. Continue. Yes, I am. Still want it to be fast. Welcome back to the world of Jurassic Park. Oh. Well, Shining in the Darkness works too. Okay, so when we last left our hero, like three minutes ago, he was still hurting. So. Har har har. Oh, good. Well, let me rest first, and then I'll go collect friends. I always loved this. This little bit of music that was only for after you had finished resting. No one's here. The, the bar is empty. I just thought that was kind of a nice little touch. Okay. Milo's in the shrine. Yeah, go ahead and record. Yes, I wish to continue. Hmm. Have to come back here when it's busy. Alright, well, let's dive back in. Could have sworn that would trigger Milo and Pyra. Ooh, yay! I caught them by surprise. And I got a whole three points of damage head start on it. So I guess I could do this. <laughs> there we go. A little bit of fast forward action there. On the PS4, that's just the uh, right trigger. Okay, this is not going well. Let's leave. Heal up, come back. Hello, grind. thumps coming from the uh, uh, direction of the living room window. I'm guessing there are some uh, June bugs trying to get them get into my apartment. What job did he have in, his, in the labyrinth? Was he a monster?
Oops, I need to heal. <laughs> Thanks, Traz. I've kind of been laying off on the voices a little bit, though, because my throat's bothering me tonight. Okay, now this time I'm going to go back into the tavern. Hey, Traz, do you remember what I have to do to uh, trigger finding my friends? Because I, I could have sworn all I had to do was just, like, leave the tavern and I run into Pyra or go to the uh, shrine and Milo's there. Unless I have to, like, level up before that happens. Oh no, it's a cave slug! Cave slug's gone at least. That'll be a nice, a nice little chunk of change. Just give me one moment here. Okay. Yeah, that's what that's what I was thinking. It's been way too long since I've played this too. In fact, I was thinking of playing it last week, and then I'm like, nah, you know what, I think I'll wait until the Genesis Collection comes out. I'm playing this because I freaking want to. <laughs> this game is not in any of my upcoming video plans on YouTube. Oh crap, failed to escape. I got a couple of turns to try again. <laughs> Hard mode. Freaking why? I'm about to die within the first half hour of playing this game. I think somewhere I still have the maps I drew. I, I, I need to see if that's the case. Oops. Ah, I keep hitting B to try to bring up my menu. Let's see. How am I doing on gold? 75. I've actually been, like, steadily decreasing in the amount of gold I have. <sighs> 10 gold pieces. Are those healing herbs, like, less than 10 gold pieces? No, they're 12. Ah, <sighs> okay. Do I have one on me? No, no I don't. Alright, well. Back to the grind! I'm just gonna keep going back and forth here. Whoa. They should really turn something like this into a VR game. Like, why there are no old-school first-person dungeon crawlers on VR yet, I, I really couldn't say. It wouldn't have to be realistic graphics or anything like that. I mean, something like some of the... Yay, I leveled up! 
Hoorah! Kalu Kale, what a wonderful day! But yeah, even something on the lines of, like, uh, the newer Dragon Quest games would probably be perfectly fine for this. I can probably make it through this fight. Yay! Well, at least I made my uh, tavern money back. So another thing that always amused me about this game is uh, when I was younger and uh, playing this game, my youth pastor's name was Carrie Vick. So I knew an older Vick. He wasn't that old at the time. And a Mrs. Vick. Spelled V-I-K. So I, that always cracked me the hell up. Yes, I wish to continue my adventure. And exit. Enter the exit. Go back here. And let's do a quick save. There we go. I really like that. I don't think they did a quick save that easily accessible on any of the other collections and it just makes sense too it doesn't feel it, it feels natural to just flick the stick to <laughs> save or load Okay, so I needed 19 XP to get to the next level. This is probably going to give me, what, three? Yeah. Well. Let's get the tavern money back. Ooh, cave slugs. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, good. <laughs> Ooh, that went well. Hopefully these guys will give me more than four gold, because... I don't want to go through another fight after this. Come on. Head up! There we go. Two gold... Er, two XP, four gold. Alright, got my ten. to be making it faster than this, but hey. Okay. Yeah, 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 stuff it. Sorry, but when I wake up in the morning, the last thing I want to do is have to talk to people. Especially in something like that, I'd be like, no, just let me go and do my thing. Don't stop and talk to me. And that's if I could form a coherent sentence. I don't wake up well. 
<laughs> kind of why I hate morning shift stuff, but... <laughs> Yeah, I know. I, like, I've told my bosses this. It's like my brain doesn't truly start working until afternoon. And no matter how early I try to get to sleep, I really can't get myself to bed before midnight. It's creeping up on 1 a.m. right now, and I have to wake up at 8.30 for, for work. Which isn't too bad, I mean... Ooh, an awesome blow! 19 points of damage, not bad. You go, Tess. Another one! You strong man, you! You're my hero! Just forget that... that... that whore of a princess and come run away with me instead. You big brawny boy, you! Ooh, a pit worm. Crap. Man, those... Those cries every time they attack used to be really disturbing to me. Especially with stuff like a worm, for some reason. I don't know why. Ew, it's a worm. Why is that worm able to scream? Worms don't have vocal cords or usually mouths. Same with slimy oozes. Well, I was able to hang in there for a lot longer that time. That's a good thing. Okay. Might actually be pretty close to leveling up. tweeting birds in the background. They did, I mean, for the hardware they had to work with, that was some really great sound engineering. Five XP to go. Do, 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 do. Enter the exit. Find a path to the labyrinth. Okay. Well, it's their fault for calling me in before I've been properly trained. I mean, they keep telling me I'm like, you know, the best swordsman in the guard. Well, I'm not seeing it. If I'm the best swordsman in the guard, what the hell does the rest of the guard look like? Of course, they did let the princess get captured, so maybe that's... Maybe I am the best of the guard, and they're all like level zero. Fast forward. Next battle should do it. No, next battle won't do it. Because for the, the one time you decided to only throw one slimy ooze at me was when I needed at least two to level up. 
you sons of bitches. There we go. Attack! Charge! This goes up a level! Um, yeah, let's, let's get into another fight here. Let's get into another couple of fights here. At least I can one-shot slimy oozes now. That that kind of opens things up a little bit more. Come on. There we go. I don't know how I don't get sick of this music. I mean, you hear the same bits of music through countless hours of gameplay. Probably should have aimed for the slime first. So when I did that sound effect just a little while ago, were you guys able to hear that? I, I'm kind of trying to see how well that goes through. I can try another one just so you're actually thinking about it here. Aloha. An awesome blow! out. Alright, how am I doing on cash? Hey, I'm actually over 100 gold now. Wait a second! Son of a bitch! Do you see anything wrong about this picture? I haven't had that shiny sword equipped that I spent 200 gold on. <laughs> Item. Equip. Tess. Short sword. That's better. Wait, maybe it was three H's. Oh, I can't remember what I have for the command. see here. Oh, that's what it was. There we go. Okay. Well then. I'll be back in just a moment. Um, I need to go track down a throat lozenge.
Okay. That's better. Now, let's go rest at the tavern. Go back to the labyrinth and start one-shotting everything instead. <laughs> I didn't think it was that difficult. Okay. So, I guess the best swordsman in the realm isn't worth much if he's not using his f***ing sword! a little bit farther away from the entrance now. That's more like it. <laughs> I guess I am! I was playing hard mode and I didn't even realize it. See, I'm not the type that gets off on hard modes, though. I want to play a game, I want to enjoy a game. I don't feel the need to be the best at a game. And I rarely replay games. So it's not usually that I'm, you know, replaying a game and trying to, uh, you know, challenge myself on something I'm familiar with. <laughs> what, did he hack Eris back in or something? This is a dead end, but I think there's a treasure chest here. Nope. Okay. I knew it was a dead end. I kind of remember a little bit about the layout of level 1. Which, after, what, 25 years of not playing this game, I, I feel kind of uh, pleased about that. Oh, 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 okay. So he was he was dead, but he didn't bother reviving him at all? Oh, that's hilarious. But you know what? That's kind of the point that I try to get to in games like this. Um, I, I put the effort into making myself overpowered so that um, fights are easy. Uh, when I played... Wild Arms 3, I had things set up to the point where um, when I finally got to the final boss, he couldn't damage me. Because all of the attacks that he did had some sort of elemental bias. And I had my um, uh, Guardian Slates set up in such a way that none of that none of my characters got damaged by elemental attacks 
and I think at least most elemental attacks would actually heal my characters. So the final boss couldn't do any damage to my party. It was actually somewhat of a letdown. But to me, it's the only blemish on a game that I have flat-out told people I feel is, a, is as close to a perfect JRPG as possible. Man. What a difference a sword makes. 24 little inches. Ooh, dark jelly. That probably tastes like grape. And the green ones probably taste like lime, so that's probably awful. I prefer to grape to lime. That said, I don't plan to, s to uh, spend a turn licking and booze just to find out. I'm just going to wait until I've got party members, and then I'm going to bet Milo mm, two gold that he wouldn't lick and ooze. He'd probably go for it, and then I'll just ask him. Fifty gold! Yay! How am I on gold? I've, I've been... Two hundred and seven! Nice! Wow! It's a very dark jelly. This jelly is darker than the other ones I've run across. Okay, time to start heading back. I was kind of hoping to get to level 5 before I had to leave, but... Oh, this isn't good. Ah. And there goes all that hard-earned gold. All right, thanks for the lift, Leneth. Ah, good, you live to fight another day. Please be more careful. You are only hope against the darkness. Right. How close am I to level 5? 41 more experience points. Okay, I think I'm going to try to get to level 5 before the end of the night. Shouldn't take too much longer. And now I should be able to actually buy a couple of herbs. Actually, I'm going to buy an angel feather first. <laughs> Okay, now I've got two herbs and an angel feather. A little bit better equipped now. Did he actually save just now? I did. Yeah, I'm glad you dropped by, Traz. Thank you very much for coming and uh, have an at least not sucky day at work. I don't know whether you enjoy your job or not. If you do enjoy your job, enjoy your job. If not, I hope it at least doesn't suck too much. Alright, so the left analog stick does work in place of the D-pad, but in something like this, I wouldn't do that. It's 
something a little bit more free roaming, yeah, maybe, but something that's grid based like this, nah, I prefer the D-pad. Yeah, you know what? I almost got to do four day weekends at my last job, but right when they were getting ready to do that, they closed the call center. But yeah, I I totally get that. I mean, really, when you're already at work, except we were going to be doing like four 10 hour work days. And the difference between an 8 hour work day and a 10 hour work day really isn't that much. Especially if you get 3 day weekends. Dark jellies were hurting me more than anything else last time, so I target that. a slimy ooze. Anything but a slimy ooze. I kinda don't remember where I am in the dungeon right now. But it doesn't really matter when I've got a uh, an angel feather. It's the get out of the Minotaur's jail free card. <laughs> and I got another angel feather. Awesome! Poisoned. Ooh, that's not good. How far am I from the leveling? It does not say. area. Oops. Okay, so they do about the same amount of damage. I can still one-shot them, though. Especially now that I remembered I've got a giant sword on me. Please be an antidote. Ah, it's an herb. Oh well. That's still helpful. Oh wow, he turned and ran. Yay! Tess goes up a level. Oh, I was hoping I'd get egress. Oh well. Alright, level 5.
Okay, how am I doing on cash? 150. Not really enough to do much of anything with. So we'll go sleep. And go to the shrine. And I still haven't run into any of my friends yet. Oh, yes, please. save. Okay, I think that'll do it for tonight. I'll probably just look up to see what how I get my party members, because this is kind of going on for a while. But um, thanks to everyone who dropped by for my uh, short little demo here. Um, I don't know if you're still here, Listexia 2. Um, I only just now noticed the uh, your message. But, yeah, that would be me from China Kitchen. And <laughs> I'm glad to see that that bit of advertising worked. I'll have to uh, put it back on there the next time they refresh that math by the register. <laughs> but, um, thanks to everyone for dropping by tonight. And uh, I will be streaming again. Well, God, I guess it's tonight now. Uh, but uh, Tuesday... PM, I will be streaming um, because there are a couple of games coming out on the PlayStation Network today that uh, I'm quite interested in showing the world. So I'll be doing that. Um, and then keep an eye on my YouTube channel because I will be putting out a video on Thursday and... Uh, I will also be doing a giveaway uh, sometime this week, so stay tuned. Have a good night, folks.